welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this JP Infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a Java project which is entitled as detecting mental disorders in social media through emotional patterns the case of anorexia and depression before seeing the execution of the project let me brief about this project so in this project the authors have proposed the concept of detecting the mental disorders by using the post that is posted in the social media by in the case of identifying the emotional patterns and here they have considered the two cases that is anorexia and depression so basically anorexia means that is a kind of disorder which is related to eating habit for example for example a person may think that I, I may become very fat because of eating a lot of food so in such kind of disorder will be coming under this anorexia and depression basically a depression is like they are not feeling well based on the states that happened and here you can see the authors have proposed the concept based on the social media communication so first they, they are identifying the emotional pattern so what is the emotional pattern and according to the emotional pattern they have been classifying the results as whether it is anorexia or it is a depression based so they are finding the mental disorder of the user so now let us see the execution of the project so we have developed this project in NetBeans IDE 8.2 so just go open NetBeans IDE 8.2 so just go to file menu and click open project now you can go to the source code location and click open project and now kindly wait till the complete project is loaded into the NetBeans IDE meanwhile let us attach the database just go to MySQL administrator login and then you can see the restore option just click this restore option and now you can see open backup file just click open backup file now go to the project location where you can see the database folder and just select the database and click open and now you can see the start restore button is enabled just click start restore and now you can see the restoration operation was finished successfully message and I click close and now you can close this MySQL administrator now coming back to the NetBeans you can see the complete project is loaded here just right click it and select run and now again it takes some more time to loading the project into the browser part kindly wait till for that and now you can see the home screen or welcome screen of the project with the project title detecting mental disorder in social media through emotional patterns the case of anorexia and depression and the abstract that is mentioned in the base paper and now here you can see the two entities that is user part and admin part so user part is like the be like uh, the social media network so an admin part is like where it will be identifying the emotional patterns and it will be showing the results whether it is a normal anorexia or depression one so just first let us go to the user part so the user part as I am a new user I'll be going for the registration part initially so first let me go to the user registration this is the user registration page where you need to enter your name your email ID date of birth gender phone number address you can choose your profile picture and you can enter your password and then click sign up and once if I given these details you can see the registration is success message and click OK 
and now it will be navigated to the user login page so in the user login page you can enter the email id and the password which you have used during the registration time and now you can click login so now you can see the login is successful message and click ok and now you can see the home screen welcome screen for the user page so here you can see with welcome the name of the user Jay Prakash and you can see the profile photo name date of birth email and address and here you can see the options that is available in a social media networks like timeline people tweet message view messages followers following and logout option now let me show you one by one all the options and then go to the main objective of the paper so in the timeline part you can see the tweets that is posted by all the users so in the people part you can see who are all the people that is available in case if you wanted to follow them you just click follow here you can see their profile picture username and status if you just click follow you can see the status is been following now and in the following part you can see this user has been now updated in the following part because if you, you have clicked the following here in the people part and in the tweet part you can able to compose tweets and you can post it let me show you that and in messages part you can see you can message directly that is this is a direct message instead of posting a tweet in a public you can directly message to a particular user and view messages you can see the message that is posted by some user and here as this user does not receive any message it has been empty now let me show you by posting some messages also and in followers part you can see who are all the users who are following so currently there is no user so that following this use this this user so that is it has been empty and in following you can see who are all you are following so that has been updated here so now for a sample let me create another user sorry let me go to user registration page and let me create some other user say example uh, g the g dot com and click sign up so now let me let me log in with the new user that I have created Ajit and click login and now if you go to the people part you can see this user that is first user Jayaprakash which I have created and if you wanted to follow them you can just click follow and if you go to the messages part again you can see the other user has been added here because that user was not really registered so now if you click message part so you can just type a message here hi jp how are you i am here so let me click enter some sample image and let me enter some image and click send and now i'll be logging out the second user so first let me log into the first user and show you and now in the followers part you can see earlier it was empty and now you can see one follower that is ajit has been following this user so it has been updated here and view messages part earlier it was empty and now you can see the inbox with the username the send date and time the message and photo of it so till now we have seen the basic operation that is all available with the online social media networks now coming to the main objective of the paper let me go to the tweet part now in the post tweet part let me post the first tweet so you can post any tweet so let me post some tweet which will be identifying the emotions and whether it will be detecting the mental disorder or not let us check out that so let me post the tweet saying that un the unattended 
calls makes me unsatisfactory so this is my tweet and let me select some image for this tweet and let me click post and now you can see that it has been added and if you go to the timeline part here you can see the username and the tweet posted by the user that added calls makes me unsatisfactory and now let me log out from the user part now let me go to the admin part so in the admin part the, uh, admin the our system should be able to identify the emotional pattern of the user tweet and also let us check the mental state whether it is a it is a case of anorexia or depression or what is the result it is been showing and now in the admin login part you enter the credentials of username and password which is a default username password admin and admin and click login and once the login is successful you can see the welcome screen for the admin and here you can see the user details view tips graph and logout part and once if you click the user details part here you can see the user details with the user id photo name date of birth and email id and here you can see the user jay prakash and ajit which was created by us and the second one is like the view tips parts and the, the view tips parts is the part where it will be identifying the emotional the mental state and here you can see the tweet that we have posted that is jay prakar the unattended calls makes me unsatisfactory and here you can see the emotion detected is anger and the mental state is depression so that it is been identified with the emotion state of the user and also what is the mental state also and once if you refer the base paper in the table 6 you can see the example of 11 sub emotions for anorexia and depression reduction where you can see the various depressed word data sets where you can see the emotions for it So here you can see the word unattended which is an anger state so accordingly the system has predicted the user's mental state so now let me log out from this part admin part now let me log uh, log in with the another user and post some other tweet and let us check what happens so now let me log in to the other user called Ajit now and now let me go to the tweet part and now let me post the tweet as I am ashamed so let me select some image for this tweet and click post and now let me log out and come to the admin part and now if you go to the view tips part here you can see uh, the user posted ajit who has posted that with i am ashamed it is been uh, and the result i have identified as anticipate and you can see the result uh, mental state has been anorexia and here in the here you can see then the anorexia what are all the words that is being identified you can see here you can see the word ashamed and it is being identified as anticipate so like that you can able to post various tweets and you can find the emotion and also the mental state of the user and you can identify and coming to the final part that is graph part so here you can see the graph which is a dynamic graph which varies this graphical representation varies according to the tweets that you are posting and what is the mental state disorder it is being predicted so now you can see the depression there are two depression tweets and there is one anorexia tweets so you can see the re result is been showing and if you wanted to see the varying result let me log out and let me go to the user part and let me sh post some other tweet and see what it happens
so let me go to the tweet part I'm worried about eating lot of food so let me post this tweet now and click post and let me log out and go to the admin part to find the results of it and now if you go to the view tits part here you can see i am worried about eating lot of food which is posted by the user jay prakash and here you can see the uh, emotion which is fear and the result is anorexia and if you go to the graph part now you can see the varying result of the graph because earlier there was one anorexia tips and now the tooth has been increased to two so the result has been varied and if you wanted to export the result you can save as jpeg or png or print it so let me export the result and show you the result and this is the exported result of the graph and let me log out from that main part and this is all about the project detecting mental disorders in social media through emotional patterns the case of anorexia and depression and thank you for watching